Yeah, I mean, let me not get everything calmed down. I got myself situated. Let me tell y'all something, man. That B2 audio raise sensitivity is, you got to pay attention to that, man. You really do. You do not need a lot of power for these boys to get loud. And I think that's the problem people having uh, here in America. Because you're thinking the American way of thinking instead of the European way of thinking. Jay Holmes from Denmark. They are over in Europe. They're more into the sound quality. That's what PSS sounds based out of. Well, I think at one time it was. I'm not for sure. Not I know not in Denmark, but it's somewhere over there. They are. I have another channel I'm watching. I forgot what P. But but they're SQ purists. At the end, let me just say that the European culture, as far as cardio, is SQ. SPL later. Well, here in America, it's SPL, and then does it sound good? Jay is coming from the, their, their school of thought from Europe. So he's using light moving mass, strong motor force for the sensitivity that it offers. For the sensitivity that it offers. He's also using a two inch force core, which is going to bring the MMS down, but he's got a very, very strong motor. However, that may be technicalities, I do not know. Uh, but if you look at his woofers, his eights, even the, even back all the way to the XM model, 84, 85. Now he had, he's at 80. He was starting, I think, in the XM model, he's at like 83 or 84. And now the last version Rampage was 83, 84. And now he's got up to 86, 87. And from what I've been explaining to is because he's got a smaller coil, the two-inch coil. Uh, his his MMS is is lighter overall than it was previously. I believe I did the, but it's definitely lighter than what most people use in the American mindset. With a two and a half is a force coil, which definitely is going to make it heavier, especially when you're trying to handle a thousand watts. Where it's going to be a four layer or eight layer, or whatever you know, all the little terms or all the. Uh, the uh, subwoofer builders that hate me. Hey, how you doing? You watch this video, and people gonna tell me, yeah, well, he, is he, does, he, does he? Will y'all be critiquing that? Which would be fine with me, as long as you're talking about it. Why does the American market eights tend to, tend to have a sensitivity of 7980, and here come BT Audio with the same size cutout? Now you can talk about digital design, which has a high sensitivity. Yeah, he's, he, he's, he's bigger than everybody. But the BTR are using the 73 8 cutout, and he's giving you a sensitivity of 86 and 87 with his rampage. Which, what does that mean? You don't have to use a lot of power for it to get a given output. I really believe in my very first videos, even though it was taking some serious drops, and they took it fine. As I started to play with it, I realized, man, I don't need that much power. I can actually... The, the silver pre out. I'm running around that last video that I made on live with that brother. I was he was at one third the power down, one third the signal of the pre out, and he was had to get out and see it for himself. They don't need a lot of power, so when you get a B2 audio of yourself, get rid of your American mindset. Man, how much power you're not gonna need that power, you're just gonna get loud. He believes in efficiency. Jay Home believes in efficiency. And maybe why the, the camp that he once tried to get with to get him some exposure here, they didn't know. That, I don't even think they knew it fully. That here you got a company that's giving you highly efficient drivers. You don't have, they can take the power, but they don't need to take that power. Overly engineered. Heed my words, man. Get them, get them while you, I know you can get the rampages for me. Uh, look into that B2 audio sound. Ask these questions here. Yeah, why are these woofers got such a high sensitivity rating? And y'all sensitivity rating is in the dirt. And for a fact, that eight is the highest. That, that the B2, I think the D1, the the D1 is 87. Yeah, the D1 is 87. The D2 is 86. Sensitivity and a thousand watts RMS. And you said take it. Yeah. I put two at one on on that M2500. I didn't need to. But. Mm. Mm. Prove me wrong, man. Having somebody share this video, having debate that. What's up with the sensitivity rating with these woofers? 
The DD is 85. The Rampage is coming in 86, 87. Uh, the, the, the Gorilla now, he is as low. He is as low. He is, I think he is as 80, 81, something like that. Uh, but what's up with that? I don't know. I don't know. Ask them. Let them, let them debunk that. Because I heard one that said that the Rampage had a Neo motor. <laughs> Man, I ain't gonna get no that. That's fair. Jay's just a beast, man. Peace.